big boys yo what up guys welcome back to another video hope you guys are doing good first day of talk today hella hella hype uh let me know in the comments how you guys enjoyed it but uh today though the market crazy stuff right so we said that special cards especially the high meta ones were going to fly after the bitcoin injection first two hours or so of tots it's happened a lot of stuff is high now we are going to look at specific stuff a lot of like fodder type cards that we can invest in before we get into it though make sure you guys do drop a like on the video subscribe if you guys are new for daily fifa 22 content especially during tots let's get into it also real quick guys stay tuned all right um so for team of the season every single team of the season every league i'm gonna have a at least one pack opening for you guys so community will have a big pack opening might even have more than one so uh stay tuned on top of the investment videos we now are going to start pack opening see how they do if they do well i'll keep doing them so uh Hope you guys enjoy them. Now to a certain couple, maybe four or five, you know, people I see in the comments. This is the only card I got for you, all right? You want to invest? Quags. All right, that's all I got for you. Now for those in the back that actually listen, pay attention, and have brains, let's get into the actual investments. Gonna start the video, guys, with Team of the Weeks. You guys already know Team of the Weeks, all right, are, you know, you guys know how many SBCs they have been used in recently. Now, for Team of the Season, it's a bit different. Um, they might start making it to where uh, we know there's going to be a guaranteed TOTS SBC. So that's going to probably require uh, TOTS for sure. Maybe they make it informs or TOTS. Because of that, guys, what I did personally today, and you guys can do whatever you want, but what I did is all of them from literally this guy Lex to Trap, 1,000 coins or so undercuts. I just stocked one of each in the club. Um, if you do want to buy more than one, though, you can keep investing the same way we have been investing. I can't guarantee they will fly as much as they did, they did before, though, because obviously team of the season, hella supply. And number two, there is, um, you know, I feel like there's going to be less SPCs that require low-rated squads. So, uh, yeah, if you do want to, though, if you're trying to go all in, these 81s right here, uh, these low-rated, 10k max, it doesn't matter. You know, if you want your coins back for the 81s, I think they quick sell for like 10,000 or 10,200. So, snipe them at 10k all consoles. At worst, if they don't go up, you quick sell them, you get your coins back. Um, the 84s, I would say like 12k, you should be very safe, kind of in the same boat. Um, they're also a little bit higher, so that does work for a lot more SBCs. But yeah, 84s, push for 12k, but under 13, still good. Um, yeah, Nick Pope, 17. Volen 16. Push for 15k for these guys. Stock one in the club. If you guys want to buy multiple, though, um, I would probably go for the super no-risk stuff, whether it's 81s or just... Up to, I would say between 81s to 85s. Because the 85s, I think, are good, going to be good um, for um, Toss SBCs, guys, and just you know mid-tier SBCs in general. Only two guys 85 rated this week as well, so not bad. Um, the 86s, all right, they're 20k. Get them for like 18. Doesn't really matter who it is. Also two of them as well, so not bad. Jesus uh, and Trap, 23, 24k right now. Trap is a bit cheaper, probably because uh, he's casual usable, but... 2k undercuts for all these. If you guys do want to stock one, go for it. Um, if you decide to go unassigned on one of the higher rated so guys, and they don't really drop anything that makes them go up, do at your own risk, right? Uh, if you want no risk, though, the 81s at 10k, anytime you need your coins back, quick sell, they are back. So uh, up to you guys, though. I did a club stock. Uh, I'll probably pick up like five more of each of these guys, low rated, 81s, 84s, but not in, like we're not going to go as ham as we normally do for other Team of the Weeks because... This is a special, uh, you know, obviously it's TOTS, so it's a special occasion. Okay, now heading over to the actual TOTS cards, all right? I'm sure some of you guys are wondering what to do. Um, those of you that bought around content time, like I said, usually the first hour or two, these cards are going to start somewhat lower because people don't know their actual prices, so they just sell them for whatever. Suarez was extinct at 1.1. He's up to 1.5. I'm really looking for a card like this. Ah, it's tough to say. So right now, right, we know everyone's playing TOTS for the red picks and whatnot. Personally, for anything this big, guys, I'm personally going to wait till like Sunday. Uh, maybe hopefully some weekend league sell-off. Also, another thing. Um, we can basically write off tomorrow, which is Saturday. There should not be the guaranteed thoughts pack, right? As early, uh, it can come as early as Sunday, in my opinion, maybe even like Tuesday. So tomorrow, if anything, I think these cards can still stay pretty high. Sunday onwards, though, uh, is when I'm going to take a look at these. So if you want to buy these, use them in weekend league. You know, try to get them around content time. Use them as quick as you can. Sell uh, before tomorrow, the next day's content time. That's what I would do for any of the cards that are, you know, a couple hundred K or even more. Uh, Gravenberg, a big one, right? Technically, he's low right now because he was been, he's been like 1.92 mil all day. Down to 1.7. Same thing, though. I think I'm going to wait till Sunday. However, if for some reason tomorrow he tanks even more, I'll feed you guys in tomorrow's video. But as of right now, though, boys, these big, big ones, I'm waiting till Sunday. 
Okay, now there's actually a couple of cards you guys can start taking a look at if you guys want. Start bidding now into content time tomorrow. Um, you should be all right. So Jared Moreno is a good one. He's 33K. Let's compare him to Gold Harry Kane real quick, uh, who is obviously same position, same rating. Uh, they're literally the same price, guys. And remember what we said earlier. These guaranteed TOTS packs, in my opinion, uh, I think last year, right, they should require TOTS. So if we're going to go for Kane, forget it. Just pick up Moreno's instead. Same price. At 33, I would sign for like 31 or so. Two counter cuts just for tax purposes. 30 if you're on Xbox. Uh, PC guys, go for like 33, 34 as of right now. But once again, don't feel like, you know, you have to rush to buy this, guys. Keep in mind, tomorrow is Saturday. They shouldn't do the guarantee pack tomorrow. So you can still check these for lightning rounds at 6UK, 7UK, 8UK. All right, but just letting you guys know, though, if you're watching this video before then, um, one to look out for, definitely tomorrow. Um, and maybe even Sunday. If they, don't do, if they don't do it Sunday, guys, my prediction is people might even panic on these cards. But hear me out. If they don't do it Sunday, it'll be on Tuesday. All right, late is Thursday, but it's going to happen. So, uh, yeah, just stick with it. Um, don't worry. Next up, we have guys that are like this card right here. Sinisera, 25K right now. Let's compare with other 89s, all right? I mean, same boat, basically. 26K, he's cheaper than Allison. Um, yeah, whenever there's guaranteed tots, these guys should be good to go. I would say ignore it on PC right now. Uh, mainly PlayStation, I do like it. Basically, their price has to be the same as their gold counterparts. So, Xbox guys, go for like 25K. But um, PlayStation guys, though, we are already looking good to go. Um, once again, tomorrow content time, 23, 24K. You can start looking now if you want to. Very, very, very safe. And these are bound to rise with the guaranteed um, toss packs. Okay, two more guys literally in the same boat. So Sinisera, you guys already saw. Um, you guys saw Moreno. Another one that we like is 91 Hilaire right here. Uh, he's about 38K right now. Let's compare it to All Black. Should be about the same. Maybe even he's a little less. All Black's 42K, guys. So... Hilaire, go for like 36k, 35 to 6 on PlayStation. I would say this price on Xbox is good. 37 to 8 on PC. Um, not bad. He'll rise with those guaranteed packs. And once again, he's literally cheaper than other 91s already. So uh, yeah, at least stock one, guys. Okay, real quick. All right, for one of these uh, these cards, if you guys do cover these, it's one of those situations. Say you buy now and they don't do it, drop it tomorrow. Um... There might be a chance where he might end up going to 35 to 6k, which is what I'm kind of telling you guys to maybe wait till tomorrow content time to see what he's at. Because if people check content time and there's the pack's not out, which it shouldn't be tomorrow, they might panic on top of lightning round, so he might get a little lower. If he's like 36 at the time uh, that you guys are on, hell, 34, 35, go for it, you know. But uh, yeah, just keep it in mind though, look during content time. Okay, real quick, guys, another thing I recommend is um, just literally go on the game, and you can go on Footman if you want. Check the cheapest link. I'm going to leave it in the description. Um, 81 guys like Yilmaz, Milik, whoever. These non-rares, I don't even care what league they're from. A couple days ago, they rose like crazy because of daily SBCs. Now they're back down to 400. I would stock in the club again. We're bound to get more daily SBCs. They'll randomly rise as they have been. doesn't even matter who it is. Um, you can literally go to players, filter out non-rares. I don't care if they're 75 rated, 76. Also, Monday, we should be getting player picks, I assume. So, uh, these guys are probably all going to go up a couple hundred anyways. So, you can either stock them now, do it the SBCs yourself, or sell them for profit later. Highly, highly recommend, all right? Do not sleep on the 82s as well. Get them all in the club. Okay, now for fodder, guys. These guys are also hella cheap right now anyways. I mean, Tadish is like 2.8K. Um, 86s are at 11K. I do think that is a decent one. 87s right now though i probably like the most if you can guys can snipe no matter who it is all consoles under 15k but aim for 14 that is the move um i mean that is like literally insane insane if you're gonna go the gold fodder route i would probably recommend 87s however um if you guys want to go for the tots cards route though once again that is a no-brainer free free coins even if they go down later uh like one or two k all right if you buy early make sure to check during content time for the best prices but even if they go down 1 to 2k, whenever we get the guarantee pack, to the moon. So, just gotta wait. Alright guys, so for a quick recap, alright? If you're looking for any of the big boys, all the, you know, super expensive ones, uh, I will look Sunday personally. If you're looking for the guys that are for, if you're investing in the uh, guarantee TOTS pack, you can start looking now. Tomorrow content time, also very good. The couple of cards I showed you guys. Um, if you guys are looking for team of the week, you can start sniping now. Once again, they might not rise as they normally do, though. So if you do want these, I recommend the 80 ones at 10K. If you don't need them, if you don't want them anymore, they don't rise, quick sell them, get your 10K back. Um, but yeah, I would definitely stock one of each, though, anyways. But yeah, focus on that, guys. Um, any comments, any questions you guys have, leave them down below. 
twitch.tv slash Joel Edwin. If you guys have any live market questions, I'll be live most days during TOTS, 2 to 3 Eastern. Uh, that's going to be my start time. So whatever 2 or 3 Eastern is, for you guys, look it up. That is when I'm going to start the stream. Drop a like on the video, guys. Make sure you guys subscribe if you guys are new for daily FIFA 22 content. See you in the next one.